everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is the first day that we're gonna play Detroit Become Human. I am very excited. I have literally only heard good things about this game. However, I've heard that it is heartbreaking and that the choices that you make can do some real damage to your emotions. So there's that. <laughs> If you're new here, hello, welcome in, my name is Caroline, it is so lovely to have you here. I am also a Twitch streamer and I create reactions content here on YouTube. If you want to check the reactions content out, you can click the link up here. And if you want to come and hang out live or check out any of my other social media, the link to that is down below in the description box. And if you're not new, welcome, welcome back. So this is a game that I feel like a lot of people has recommended to me, not just online, but like friends IRL as well. It's a game that I do think I would really enjoy but also struggle with because of the choices that you need to make from what I know about it. I don't know much more than that it's a world where you have androids living amongst you and that there's a constant sort of fight as to whether you should care about their emotions or not which is gonna be a very interesting subject I feel like. I don't really know much more than that to be completely honest, but I have previously played the Life is Strange games. Now I'm not saying that these games are the same thing, but they are both butterfly effect games, which is sort of what led me down the path of thinking, hmm, you know, maybe I should play this game and then more and more people recommended it to me and here we are. I feel like I don't have a lot more to say about the game itself since I do not know much about it, so this is gonna be basically a blind playthrough. I've seen snippets from the game, from showcases, or when friends have played it like live on stream, but not enough to like give me any actual context and understanding what character is who, nothing like that. Like I still don't understand the story whatsoever. So I'm very excited to jump into this. I might need handholds. I know that there is two level like two settings there is experience and there's casual i feel like it's difficult because the experience to me sounds like it's pretty difficult like above normal whereas the casual feels like it's less than normal what i think i'm gonna do is i'm gonna start with casual i am mainly playing this game for the story and the choices that you make the rest is not as important however if i feel like it's too easy or if a lot of people would prefer that I play the experienced version, then we could swap, I'm assuming. Hopefully. Well, if you do want me to swap and you think that I would enjoy swapping more, you better let me know in this video because I'm sure that I could replay the first part, if that's a problem. But I don't think I have a lot more to say. I think we're just gonna jump straight into it and I hope that you're excited for this brand new playthrough. You are now ready to begin Detroit. Remember, Ooh. this is not just a story oh don't tell this don't say that is our future don't tell me that i'm freaking out look how gorgeous she looks 2038 the thing is that's not even that far away by now like not that far away it's making me a little scared oh gosh i love that they how they incorporated like the start of the game to be like a part of the game where you choose all of your settings. I thought that that looked pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. I really enjoy that. Oh, I recognize him. I recognize him. Okay. On site. On site. It says Android. And he had that little like blue thing. Okay, move. Use this one. Gotcha. The quality of this game is impressive i feel like i'm gonna get oh what the heck happened here <gasps> interact using the right stick take what's happening okay wait why am i so nervous phillips caroline phillips john phillips emma family portrait Oh, I see how I do it now. Okay, where are we? Who are we? There is like the aquarium. Oh, no, the poor fishes. Are they okay? Oh, dwarf Grammy? No, we'll save it. Why would I leave it? 
Why would I leave the fish? It takes like two seconds to put it back into the water, right? Of course we gotta save it. Did it say software instability? I keep thinking I'm gonna use the right trick to like fix the camera. Albie. <gasps> Look around using the right trick. Oh, can we find something here? If you are new to my channel, I am pretty slow when playing games. I like taking my time. I know it's not everyone's cup of tea, but I still manage to miss it sometimes, so please be kind. I, I'm, I'm trying. Okay, maybe there wasn't anything that we were like supposed to see in here. But hey, the fish seems happy and holy frick, there is... Okay, there's gunshots. I just realized we're probably at the crime scene and here I am just thinking about the little fish. Oh! Please, please, you gotta save my little Is that girl. Caroline? Wait. You're sending an android? All right, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. Oh. You. What's happened? Why aren't you sending a real person? Uh. Okay, so something's happened and the mum doesn't want me to find Captain Allen. Okay, the mum doesn't want us to go near her daughter, I'm guessing, to consult your objectives. RT? Oh, here we go. Ooh, show your objectives and interactions. Okay, so I see where Captain Allen is, I'm assuming. Holy fudge, why am I so scared? Should I like, should I look around? Do I need to hurry? I don't know what's expected of me in this game and I'm nervous about it. <gasps> That's her room, isn't it? Oh wait, hang on. Why? Am I just gonna, yep, we're just gonna... What happened here? Oh, what's happening here? Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> am I, am I looking at too much? Should I just maybe go straight for it? I'm just scared I'm gonna miss something, you know? Talk. Captain Allen. Here we go. My name is Connor. Connor, right! I do remember that he's called Connor now, actually. I've seen I've seen him before. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. Get it? If it falls. She falls. Wait, it as in like a droid? Uh, well, Do you I don't know. It's been behaving strangely before this. I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Has it experienced an emotional I don't know what shock? You... <laughs> I feel like I'm like breathless. Listen. Whew. Saving that kid is all that matters. Yeah, but we so gotta know how to do it, right? right now, or I'll take care of it. Are you kidding? It said every second count. What? Why were there two stuff in it? Wait. It says understand what happened. Freak, but every second count. I only have 48. That's not a good number. Use the right stick to move the cursor. doing it right now here we go okay that's the kind of gun that's been used now what am I wasting time I think I am the kind of gun reconstruct Frick, what is this? Use these? Oh, here we go. Okay, gun was taken from there. 
everything fell out, took out the gun. Oh wait, I'm, I'm, I'm supposed to analyze this part, I'm so dumb. Deviant took Fada's gun, okay. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I don't know why that ha why that matters. <gasps> okay, we got we got some more information. That's good. Search search a hostages room. Okay, so we're supposed. To <gasps> Is that the dad? Frick. Okay, I feel like I'm talking way less because I'm so focused and scared. I don't want to fail this. It's a child. Bullet wound, lower lung. Gotcha. Do I need to remember any of this or can I just like go with the flow? Upper lung. Deceased, John Phillips. Okay, so that's the dad. The dad is dead. And I'm guessing by the android? Left kidney. Oh, do we get to see how this all happens then? Okay. Father was holding something. Hmm? I thought, wait, I thought the yellow part was where I could... Oh, am I supposed to move the camera? Gotcha. Uh-huh. Okay, wait. And that's a tablet, maybe? Um. How do I... Do I reconstruct it from here? Or am I done? Oh, maybe that's some the tablet, 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 tablet. Take it. Unlock. Your order for an AP New. Okay, it was gonna be replaced. Gotcha. So maybe it got upset because it'd been working with the family for a long time and felt rejected. Because I could see that. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need to hurry up. I need to. Oh. Is there something I should see here? Okay, more droids. More droids, less work. Frick! Am I like killing off people because I'm so slow? My heart is going so quick right now. I'm. Oh, frick! I thought I thought I was waiting for something. God dang it! I don't want to fail. I don't want to fail. I don't want to fail. This is. I don't know why I'm turning this off, but it felt right, okay? It probably- that was probably like the worst time I could have spent. Is there any- oh, there, wait, wait, wait. Should take down this and this is from the droid? Like, blood? Fresh blue blood. Okay. Deviant mullet, PL600. Okay, why is my rate not even going up that much? I don't even know if this is helping, honestly. Deceased. This, this thing with being quick, not doing great. Reconstruct. Hostage witness the shooting. Okay, that might be valuable information. Cop shot deviant. Also good information. And the gun is under there. Weapon located. Okay. Does that help? A little bit. Hostages room? What? Where is the hostages? Is that the girls room? Wait, is that where I'm supposed to go? L 
will be. And that's is that supposed to. Can I run? No. Please, can we can we hurry up? Oh my god, I should have gone into her room before, shouldn't I? Hurry, hurry, hurry. My heart is going so fast. I know I need to be quick. But I also feel like I need information. Anything. Anything. Tablet. Is there a picture of them? Is there like a bond? They were like friends. Oh, Daniel. Gotcha. Daniel, and then he took her hostage, shot her dad in a cop. She witnessed it. Okay, is this like a favorite song? Child in here, the gunshots. Okay. I hope that helped. Okay, it's examined. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I am especially nervous knowing it's a child out there. I don't want to mess this up. Please don't come for me if I fail for this. Please, I, I promise you I'm gonna try my best. Oh my god, I didn't see that coming. Oh. Stay back! Don't come any closer or I'll jump! Oh my god, is this how they started the game? Like, I mean, obviously, but I didn't ex I didn't expect that. I'm gonna be completely honest. Hi, Daniel. Now, my name is Connor. How do you know my name? I know a lot of things about you. I just... I've come uh... to get you out of this. Why did it go down? Why did it go down? No. I know you're angry, Daniel. But you need to trust me and let me help. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is all this <gasps> oh my god, I like stop. that he moves the chair out of the way. I want all this to stop. He's losing blood. If we don't get him to a hospital, he's going to die. All humans die eventually. What does it matter if this one dies now? Okay, I'm panicking. I'm so going to much. apply a tourniquet. I hope it helps. Don't touch him. Touch him, and I kill you. Okay. Oh gosh. Okay, that helped. That helped. I know you and Emma were very close. I hope this helps too. I hope that you he think doesn't. She betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me. I thought she loved me. She does. Emma's but a kid, right? No, Emma loves you. She's just like all the other humans. No. She likes you a lot. There's no way out, Daniel. What you've Did I choose the wrong serious. one? The only question is whether or not you take another innocent life. Oh my god. It's not up to you. I'm I know. holding all the cards. I know. If I, I die, she dies. You hear me? Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? Please. Please tell me I can do this. Listen. I know it's not your fault. These I feel emotions so bad you're for feeling him too. are just errors in your software. No. It's not my fault. Okay. I never wanted this. No, I know. You didn't want this, I loved right? Them. I don't know? think he did. Like he genuinely seemed well, to have loved them. To them. <laughs> Just a slave to be ordered around. Okay. I can't stand that noise anymore. <laughs> Tell that helicopter to get out of here. I really hope I'm not doing something bad. I, I really hope I'm doing right thing here. There. I okay. Yeah. It, it went up. It went up. You have to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go, and I promise you, everything will be fine. I, I am sweating. I'm not even kidding. 
And, and I want a car. Sure, go ahead. When I'm yep. outside the city, I'll let her go. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go, and I promise you won't be hurt. Okay, we're doing good. I don't want to die. We're doing good. You took human lives. Nothing can stop them from destroying you now. No, that would be one more life won't do you. Why did I think? Why did I pick that? I'm so dumb. I sh I, I don't. Spent my life taking orders. The clock ticking is what makes me panic. I don't have the time to. Now it's my turn no, to decide. No, please, 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 please. Oh, don't tell me I have to do something. No, please tell me I can save her. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did this. Cause she's fine. How about Connor though? You're joking, right? You're absolutely joking. Okay, mission is successful, but is he okay? Okay, that probably wasn't the best. I feel like I did so well up until the last point where, I don't know, my brain just couldn't cope. It was it was a quick thing, okay? And I didn't know what to pick and I pick, I pick wrong. I get it, I pick wrong. Can they help him? Can they save him? Okay, does this mean I can breathe? This is a scene's scenes flowchart. You can review the paths you would have you've take taken yet to explore and what possibilities you've unlocked. Each node earns you points they can spend in extras. Due to the nature of the game, some nodes and endings will not be continued towards the complete. <gasps> Does that mean I can, like, know right after, almost like after the scene, where I would have gone? I find that pretty interesting, because from what, like, from what I know, this game has a lot more endings and like possible scenarios. This was just a first encounter, very, very intense way to start a game. I'm, I usually talk a lot. I feel like I couldn't get a word out because I was literally just panicking the entire time and I was trying to read and get the controls and understand what's happening and like figure out do I need to remember any information or like is, does the game remember it for me? I was like there was a lot and there was a child. Come on like there was a child. I'm happy the mission was successful but I feel so angry at myself for like failing at that very last point. Whew. It's gonna be interesting to see what this one looks like. Oh, wait, I can't see. Okay, so this is this is what I did. We started, talked to the... I said, oh, I missed one thing there. I saved the fish though. And then I searched for clues. I missed one clue. I missed one thing outside, but I got the SWAT, confronted a deviant, uh, negotiate friendly, leave wooden cop. Dismiss helicopter. Okay, so if I would have Oh, but there's like okay, I'm trying to understand this. So the there's a red lock, like ruined cop, and then there's a blue line, and then there's like a red lock. Does that mean be that I couldn't take that? Or because I diminished the helicopter? Maybe? Okay, be honest. Wow, okay, so there was oh <gasps> Okay, there I okay, so from here we have be honest and then there's four other alternatives and the the complete outcomes is like four more than the one I got. So Deviant jumps with Emma, Connor left for Emma and fell. That's what happened to me, which oh wait, no, there's actually more. <gasps> okay, wait, Deviant jumps with Emma. Does this mean that if Connor didn't leap for Emma, or if I wasn't like close enough, would that have resulted in Connor falling, uh, or Emma falling with the deviant? I am assuming that like maybe this right under might have helped if I wasn't being honest because that was my mistake, and I know that if I would have gotten that one, maybe he wouldn't have jumped, which would have been nice. Wait. That is available. 
locked parts. Okay, so that's just because I choose one thing. Cross chapter impact, action, dialogue, success. Ooh, okay, full. I got the skull. Death make, makes sense. I, I'm sorry, Connor. I'm sorry. I promise I didn't try to kill you. November 5th. Are we rebooting Connor now, or...? This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. Languages and dialects, and handles the is this an Android store? This feels so weird. Honey, it looks amazing. This is exactly what we need. How much did you say it costs? Are we Connor still or someone else? Because, I mean, how do I? Oh, God. I feel so uncomfortable just seeing all of this and like it feels like you, we're being sold. Well, I guess we are. That's weird. Surveillance mode contacts emergency services if there's break-in or if it detects smoke. How much is that one over there? The NPA. I'm not gonna lie. I do feel a little bit uncomfortable. There it is. Uh oh, who is he? It's a bit difficult getting it back in working order. Okay. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. A stupid accident. Wait. Uh, see. Anyway. Did he own destroyed? Except that Did something to, to it? Told them it was hit like by a car? I hope you don't mind. That'll be fine. Okay. Okay. Well, who is he? He's terrifying. Ax four hundred. Register your name. Kara. Kara. Okay, so that's not. My name is Kara. Okay, yeah, that's not the same. That's not the same. Okay, that's not Connor. Okay. What did he do to Kara? What did he do to Kara? The the vibe I get from this guy is not good, and the way he like brushed it off. Like, I'll get hit by a car. Uh, I can't be asked. Like, this is the most difficult thing he's ever done, is having to, like, pick up his broken droid. I... I don't like him. <laughs> is it bad that I says, say that already? Like, I know nothing about him, but I, I get a really bad vibe off of him. This game is so beautiful. Like, it, ab it looks absolutely fantastic. It's got a really, really nice intro to it as well. So 2038 is basically way ahead of us now, where droids is a natural part of the society. I guess that we have like cop droids, is what I'm assuming that Connor was or some something like that. We've got Kara here who I don't know what kind of droid she is, but she seems to be living with the family. The same as like the Deviant, um, was he called Daniel? He seemed to also be living with the family, right? I lost my job because of droids, help me. I do, yeah. That makes, that makes sense. If you have a lot of droids, there are a lot of jobs that's gonna be possible to hand over to droids instead. Oh gosh, I'm so excited for this. I've got goosebumps. The, the start was just so intense. I feel like my brain hasn't fully registered anything yet. November 5th, 9.38 a.m. Oh, is it a third droid? I am so impressed by what how this game looks. Would you like to go home now? Go to Bellini yes, paint it. shop. Here. Let me help you. Oh. Oh, thank you, dear. Oh, there's something here. Hang on. Tech Addict, Secrets of Androids, how Cyberlife designs its androids to coexist with humans. VR MMORPG reaches 1 million users. 
Secret of Androids, how cyber life designs its androids to coexist with humans. Designing androids that are easy, easily accepted by humans was a huge challenge cyber life had to overcome. Jason Graff, director, director of the humanization department at cyber life, unveiled some of his design's secrets in our recent interview. The first android was never perfect. Uh, no, the first androids were perfect. They had perfect faces, perfect expressions, and they would soon realize that there was something disturbing about them that made people feel uncomfortable. Cyberlife worked on ways to humanize its machines so that they could enter our homes and become a new member of our family. Okay. If you actually want droids to become a part of your family, how can you talk about them like it and stuff? Like if you genuinely want them to become a part of your family, I feel like that's a little bit weird, huh? Is it just me? They created androids with both genders and all ethnicities, analyzing thousands of voices to find the most pleasing tones. Realistic blinking was perfected, though totally unnecessary, along with breathing, facial hair, and many other humanizing traits. This perfect simulation of humanity, down to the details that Andrew simply don't need, is the secret to cyber life's this, okay, the design success, that makes sense. World's temperatures increased by 3 degrees in 2000, green earth, climate change up, how the environment is changing America's society. Miami to heighten the sea wall further 10 meters, holy fudge. The, the worst is like, this is not just in the game. Like we're not just talking about the game here. How the environmental is changing America's society. Okay, so that's also a big part of everything that's happening now. Interesting. I feel like people are gonna get annoyed at me if I read everything, sorry. Okay. I'm so curious about who we are. Who is who is this dude? What is he, what is he doing? Who? What is? I guess I guess I could ask who he's working for, right? Oh, dang it! I wanted to go that way. I wanted to explore. Like I gotta say, like the camera stuff is a little confusing. I want to use like the the other joystick to do that, but yeah. Not five miles away from your goal. <laughs> I don't think that that dude wanted to know that. That's that's my takeaway there. Uh huh. Retrieve order eight four seven at Bellini Paints. All right, I guess we shall do that. I feel like I'm gonna walk into people and that's gonna cause trouble. Ooh. Human music, want to hear music with soul. Why does that feel heartbreaking? I guess that the androids has also sort of taken over like the music industry so that the people who used to work with it are not long like no longer properly able to do it, but am I gonna get in trouble if I continue listening? Because I'm not paying. Oh, there's a demonstration going on there. Do we want to avoid that, maybe? I do wonder how this would play out in, like, society. I feel like this is pretty realistic, some parts of it. I definitely think that there would be demonstrations and people, like, talking about how, how bad droids are and what they're doing and all of that, but... Is not this way, gotcha. Oh, here it is. I'm like trying to listen into the conversations a little bit too. Oh, 
Oh, I like that. I like how you open stuff and how you do things. Identification verified. They do look extremely human. Here is your order number 847. That will be 63.99. Please confirm payment. Payment confirmed. Transaction complete. It's so cool. His eyes are so pretty. Oh, we're taking the bus home. Gotcha. Oh no, does that mean we have to go by the protesters? Dang it. Oh, RB to switch camera angle. Okay. I know. I was just gonna say, I know we're not going this way, but I just needed, I just wanted to see. Is this the bus? No. The bus is this way. Gotcha. I'm trying to figure out if I can run. Well, nope. I guess not. Look, okay, I just want to take a moment. Look how beautiful this is. Look at the water on the stones, like the like making them look all shiny. I know that's a detail that's like small, but those are the things that makes the game feel more real. I think that's really freaking cool. We got some cleaner... cleaners as well? Okay, let me double check where the bus is. Oh, it's over there, okay. Maybe we'll go around. The way I read on the bus, okay. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're in Detroit! And then I was like... Why did I even think that? The game is literally called Detroit Become Human. How dumb can I be? I it just I needed to share it because it just like, it popped up in my head and I was like, huh? Okay, there. We're just gonna we're just gonna step on this and hope that we don't cause any trouble. I'm I'm scared. I'm scared of the protest. It's fine. <gasps> what? That looks so sad. You want them to become part of your families, but you keep them standing at the back of the bus on a separate... I don't know. I have mixed feelings about this. Like, I know that they're droids, but if the whole idea is to really bring them into society, then that doesn't really make it feel like you bring them into society. <gasps> Shades of colors. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, did I miss a lot of stuff? Frick. <laughs> Walk in the park. I listened to the busker. I read Secret of Androids, read the climate change. Apparently there was a lot of other things I could have done. Paints. Gosh, I could have gotten more sidetracked. Okay, question is question here is did I miss out on things or were I saved from things I'm really really eager to know that I hope I do get to know that at some point oh we're back with Kara we're back with Kara oh gosh that whole house burned down from what I see here, it looks like this part of town is a little bit rougher. Right? I don't know how I feel about it. This dude scares me, okay? He scares me. Join Todd. Okay, so his name is Todd. You coming? Okay. I'm just gonna tell you now. I am sure he's not a good person. I am sure. You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. 
You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Is he Alice! Is Alice! he talking about his daughter like that? Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. So she's been here Got before, it? but they couldn't restore her memories? Get started down here, then you do upstairs. So she's basically a child carer, home and maintenance, everything? Urgent tasks. Oh, okay, we'll start with the urgent then, I guess. Wait. Oh, I thought it was that trash bag. Okay, well, here we go. My bad. TV on. This doesn't feel good. Yeah. Maybe. I guess it's convenient, but need. doesn't that mean he doesn't take care of his family at all? I don't know what I think yeah, about yeah. that. I can get that. It doesn't seem like he cares a lot for his yeah, daughter yeah. either, to be honest. I'll bring it tomorrow. It's interesting, you do see a difference in their clothing yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Coffee table, okay, maybe we should go around this way. I'm legit scared of him. I don't want to go in front of his game. I, I just have this stomach feeling, like this gut feeling telling me that she was not hit by a car and if she was it was his fault that's how it feels oh application for a credit card rejected over oh, okay they have a lot of money that they are and they can't get a loan and they can't get a new credit card. How does he afford like a droid doing all of this if he can't afford his like normal bills? That's hmm. Guess that might that might be that might be a problem. Although the there is another droid in this area, so I don't know, maybe droids aren't that expensive or like I guess maybe humans deem it necessary. Oh, Taxi business. Finish first floor. Did I finish it though? There was urgent tasks, but there were optional ones as well. Is this an optional one? Oh, missing component. Does that... Order the component? What is he doing? I don't want to... I don't know if I want to know... Oh, I need to pick that up first. I don't know if I want to know why he sounded like that. Okay, headache. What? Why does he say that about her? No, oh, she's adorable. Don't have kids if you're not if you don't want if if you don't want to take care of your kids and if you're not going to love them and care for them, do not get kids. Don't don't get kids. I'm just going to say it. No. You can choose not to have them. Don't have them. This Todd guy does not seem like a good dad. Ooh, I do like that this is interactive. The thing is, it's been pretty intense so far, but I have a feeling that this game is gonna get more intense and that I'm gonna cry my heart out many times. Oh, she must feel lonely. She's just a kid who's not getting any attention, right? I'm sure that that Kara is really good for her, right? Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! 
right away. Yep, okay, doing that straight away. I'm like really scared of delaying. I don't I don't want him to do something to her or her or his kid. Did I finish the dishes? Let me see if there is something else. Can I do something in here? No? Okay. Do we talk to Alice? Do we not talk to Alice? He told me to clean down here. It's obviously not fully clean, but... Oh, I don't know if I dare reading that, honestly. Okay. Oh, Alice in Wonderland. Cute. Okay, he's watching hockey. Is that like information that could be good to know? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna be a little... Oh my god, I'm sorry, Cara. <laughs> I made her go like, go in circle. Oh, it's a sports magazine, Android Power. Oh, so this is about Android Pitcher broke the 120 miles per hour mark. The human battle wasn't able to swing until the ball already reached. Oh, so is this about whether you should get to use them or not? Home run fans of the magic of sport is seeing the limits of human potential. A machine is breaking these kind of records. It's just... Okay. Century, a transport invasion that's shaking up California, connecting the dots, politics in focus. Are American senators really corrupt? China are 10,000 people, holy frick. The transportation in innovation that's shaking up California, the subtube. To, ooh, from Manhattan to LA in two hours, less than half the five hour flight time. Holy frick, I wish that that was a thing. That'd be so convenient. Real estate isn't the only thing that's shaking up school places are rapidly filling up and the suburban retailers are racking up prices oh yeah i guess all of these things has to make a huge impact on um, the economy as well right like the the technology go going better here. i'll head upstairs do what you have to do but stop bothering me should i not tell them I thought if I went up without saying anything, he might get angry at that, so I did take a little bit of a chance here. The details and the way the camera, it makes it look so real. Amazing. Okay, tidy. He's got a lot of sports magazines. Android slam. Okay, Android quarterbacks. Hmm. Do I get anything out of reading these? American football has largely resisted the spread of Android players. Following the recent unveiling of technical demo, an Android quarterback. Ooh. I guess it is a question of whether you want to see the human potential or if you just want to see a, a good game. Despite the reservations, some consider this simply a matter of time, with basketball and baseball already contemplating Android players, a lead sporting QB might be just around the corner. Tech added, price of life, how driverless vehicles make life and death decisions, space tourism, is Mars your next holiday destination? This is even scarier because like some of these things are just not that far away. When a driver's a vehicle forces, uh, foresees an accident, the car's computer makes life and death decisions, for example, deciding which of the two pedestrians to hit. But the exact process by which car make decisions is not very well understood. 
The cause imaging system gathers data to determine the pedestrian's age, gender, life expectancy. Oh, that's terrifying. To determine martial status, employee rec employment record, expect life expectancy, and whether they have children. The car assigns the value. Okay, in a, in a sense, that's really freaking cool. But also, we're letting a computer decide who's to live or die. I mean, no one should decide that, not a human either. And if a computer can decide that, like the car in this case, doesn't that mean that we could program it to prioritize certain things and down-prioritize certain things? All this minds and release now, but Felix Gamble, the anti automation League, says that the system makes just somebody with a criminal record is not necessarily less valuable to society than a doctor. See, this is what I mean. Like, they could pick and choose based on what someone tells it to pick and choose from. We want our cars to make the best possible choices. Yeah. Okay, that's a really interesting decision, like discussion, and I feel like that's something that could be something that comes up for discussion in the future. Like, we are trying to make self-driving cars, so they would have to somehow make decisions. And who's to decide what decisions are to be made? Like, those questions are so relevant. <gasps> Alice! Cute. Clean mess. There's a lot of mess. Oh, he is a heavy drinker. I mean, I could have figured by the beer, but like, this is strong liquor as well. I'm not surprised, Todd. I am not surprised. I'm not a Todd fan here, okay? I'm just, I'm just gonna go out and tell you I'm not a Todd fan. Switch on? What is it that I switch on? And now to sports. Ooh. Another two hundred twenty-five thousand jobs. Unemployment that holds all-time high. According to the Department of Labor, bringing the unemployment figure up to thirty-seven point three. Okay, maybe we'll turn it off. I just realized I was like, oh, cool. Maybe we could watch the news, but actually, maybe I don't want that because I don't want him to be like, hey, Cara, are you watching TV? You're, I didn't pay for you to watch TV. There's something more I need to do in here. Hang on. Antidepressant contains teen fine. Oh, it's a gun. Okay, now I know that too, I guess. You've unlocked a dialogue or action. Often... Oh, ooh, so actually going around looking at things could be good for several reasons. Yeah, that's good to know. Wait, does that mean I finished in here? See, I am terrified of him. I'm not even in the game. I'm sorry. I'm doing all the optional tasks just so that I don't have to deal with Todd because I'm terrified of Todd, okay? Does this mean... Oh, bathroom and toilet. I was like... Why did it only let me do that, like, super quickly? Wasn't there two things I could do? Now I see why. Different, um, different places. Bathroom and toilets, not the same here. <laughs> mop floor. Here's the mop, right? She really just came back after a car accident, or something like a car accident, and just going straight to work. Clean bathroom, good, right? I'm guessing we're gonna go in here? I just wanna tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes, is that okay, Alice?
Yeah, get some air in here. Okay, wait, so I learned about the medication and I learned that you can climb out here and the gun, I'm guessing. <gasps> she looks terrified. Poor thing. She's literally just a child. Come on. She seems very curious though. I guess that they knew each other before, but Kara doesn't remember it. Is that it? Can I not talk to her? Sorry. Ooh, what is this? Okay, it's cute because she's called Alice, Alice and Wonderland. she's really liking him. Alice in Wonderland, I'm guessing. Of course. Neutral. Ooh, okay. So seeing these kind of things can make her get a specific emotion from Kara. Oh, look, she even stepped over that. Oh, I feel like this is private. Should we not open that or should I open that? Did I miss something? Okay, I, I, want, I want her to like us. Does she like stories and reading? Seems you like reading. And drawing? You know, that's pretty good. She's creative, I like that. Dang, why do I feel like I missed something in here? Okay, maybe I didn't. Ooh. Sorry, I keep almost stepping on her book all the time. I'm guessing I'm supposed to go down and talk to Todd, right? Clean upstairs. Wait, so I did miss something? Oh, here is something. Oh, gosh, I knew. I was like, that's probably something super, super simple. Ooh, are we gonna learn something about Todd now? Okay. What was that? Can I... Oh, I can't read that. Dang, I wanted to know what the papers were. Okay, we can at least talk to Alice now. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Aww. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How okay. did you choose it? I want to be sure she likes us. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. She really seems shy, but you're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. I don't want to make things worse. Oh, that's so cute. Did she give us a key <gasps> to the box? To the box. Okay, so she's shy. She misses Kara. I get that. I'm guessing we can... A-W, so Alice and then her last name. Is that a picture of her mom? <gasps> Forklore, cute. For luck. Oh, that's them as a family. I, guess, I wonder what happened to her mom, and I wonder if that's what like destroyed her dad. Ooh. Okay. 
I don't know what these picture means. Is that car? Is that? <gasps> is it Alice and Todd and then Kara? <gasps> oh God, I was so right. Okay, so Todd did something to to Alice. Kara saw it, reacted to it, and Todd hurt her. Right. I see. This is what I'm saying. I knew he wasn't a good person. Can I take the key back? Or do I need to leave it there? Fudge. Okay, I think I need to leave it. I don't want Todd to see that. I don't I don't want Todd to do something to Alice because he saw the drawings or something. It's not it wouldn't be impossible for that to happen, you know? What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. She's a child. Yeah, That's usually what they do. You think your dad's a low life. What? Huh? Fucking loser. Can't Where get are job. you getting this from? Care his family. Todd, she's a child. Don't you think I tried to make things work? Of course she does. Whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up. Don't. Know what you think don't do anything. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? What the heck? Say it. You hate me! Why are you like this to your own child? God. You need help. What you doing? need help. Exactly. What the heck are you doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sure that he loves her deep down, but you know this is just you, not you? okay. You know I love you. It doesn't actually matter if you love her, if you're gonna treat her like this. Oh my god, my heart. A new home. Achie we got an achievement called Secrets. Oh gosh, okay. That was a lot of things. Join Todd. Okay, so I read it. The articles of Wash the Dishes. There was apparently a whole other thing that could have happened. Took out the trash. Asked to go upstairs. Went upstairs. Dang, did I miss optional tasks downstairs then? Oh, fudge! Okay, I'm learning. See, for the first floor, I think there was optional tasks that I missed, potentially, or things that I could have seen. Whereas on the upper floor, look at this. I found so much. I discovered a way down and a gun and did a lot of extra stuff. And we also got to open the box and then finish cleaning. So cool. Okay, that was it for today's video. I am recording this pretty late, so I'm trying to be quiet if you'd like. I hope the vo audio volume is okay. I tried to adjust the mic and the stuff. If it wasn't, I'm terribly sorry. Um, time is short. I. It's, it's hard to be able to do everything in life and I really wanted to get this recording done in time and so I can edit it and I also really wanted to test this game out. The beginning of this game was not what I expected. I... so intense. I... I, I feel like I was at a loss for word. I'm so sorry. I hope Connor is okay because I haven't seen Connor since. And I hope that that doesn't like ex exclude him from the game because I accidentally got him to save the child but jump with a droid. I think I'm learning that you need to be careful where you look so that you can get clues to everything around you that you might find useful. Clues could be to like conversations or other things I'm assuming. It was hard because I think I was still stressed from the first part of the game where I had to do everything so quickly that it was hard to sort of get used to needing to do things slow and I think I need to learn to just like when there's no timer anywhere like when there's no dialogue options where I need to be like oh it's like answer quickly maybe I should just take my time but so far I absolutely love this game I don't know how long this game is honestly and I don't know what to expect from it but I am I am I am so nervous and so excited like so far so freaking good i really appreciate you watching this is my first time playing it it is a basically a blind playthrough have seen bits of it but 
not really enough to understand what's happening in the game strong start we've got three androids that we're following so far i believe it's kara it's connor and then did we i don't actually know if we got to know the name but we by the droid that we took the bus home with but i'm guessing that maybe those are like the three main characters that we're gonna follow and it's gonna be so interesting to see if they ever get to meet and uh, like their destinies. Connors doesn't look very bright. Chorus doesn't look very bright. I do feel like I'm gonna need a lot of setting sprays and also a lot of napkins to get through this. But thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think so far of this game, of the playthrough. I really appreciate your being here. If you like the video, it would mean a lot if you wanted to give it a thumbs up. Of course, comment down below and subscribe for upcoming videos. I really do enjoy games like this. So I hope to play more of them in the future. And I hope that you'll have an amazing rest of your day, night, morning, midnight snack, breakfast, whichever time it is for you when you're watching this. And I'll see you very soon. Bye.